Frankly speaking, I'm getting jitters almost the same as when I participated in World Supermodel in 2003. And it just feels the same. Now we together will go into the hall. Let's go inside. This is the very lobby of the Hotel Martinez where all bloggers are gathering. There is a lot of security here. I'm sure they are already taking their seats by the tables where the award ceremony and the dinner will be held for the best bloggers and influencers. Welcome to the World Influencers and Bloggers Awards 2021. Hello to the ones who are behind the scenes and behind the globe. We are delighted to greet all of you who made it through the restrictions and cancelled flights here during Cannes Film Festival in the stunning Martinez Hotel to celebrate our award ceremony. As you can see, looking at guests, this is really bloggers party. Everyone is staring at their phones. <laughs> and now we officially announce the World Influencers and Bloggers Awards Ceremony Open! The best travel account title in expert blogger category goes to... Doran Is. Ladies and gentlemen, please put your hands together. The best animal account title in expert blogger category goes to... Malcolm Zekita. Ooh. When you walk with him, if someone uh, recognizes him, like on the street? Yes, it, it comes. Yeah, I come from southern France, and in, in southern France they really know him. But I see some people uh, in Cannes recognizing him. Okay, and one more question. Is he doing any money on this? Money? Money, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If yes, someone is paying to him? Yes, this is my boss, and this is our full-time job. <laughs> it's a superstar dog. <laughs> Now let's come back to our main World Influencers and Bloggers Awards winners. The supermodel and television personality. Lifestyle Influencer Consciousness and Modern Values Award goes to Natalia Gozzi. million people following his every bite. He is the biggest food influencer in the world. Second year in a row, ladies and gentlemen, the winner of the Global Food Influencer title is Food God. Like, when you realize that you become a famous? Well, I've been on TV for like 14 years on a very big show, so it's been a long time coming. Uh, it's great because everybody knows us like around the world, so it's different than people specifically in each area. So it's kind of fun to go all different countries and have people know. Cool, and how you choose your topics? Like, are you deciding your for a ahead what you will post or is just you wake up and like today I will post this and this no, like me no. <laughs> that's why I don't have three million followers my, my stuff is very hard to find so I have to kind of uh, look and search and, and people send me cool stuff and then I have to go through it and then go see it and you know in and out so 
So now we can tell you that to be a blogger, it's a big job. It's a lot of work, a lot, and to stay relevant and keep original. Uh, you're doing a lot of things and you have three kids, me, I'm just have, having just two, so uh, uh, are you doing all of this by yourself? No, not. Uh, right now I have, we're, all the kids are here in Cannes with us. Uh, my husband and I work together and then we brought grandma with us so that it's a family affair. So like today we went on the carousels, we went for a long walk up into the like historic part of Cannes and then now mommy has to go to work and they go yeah. to sleep. So it's crazy, it's a crazy life, I'm sure you know it, but it's like the best life in that you get to share the most wacky, crazy experiences. I even told my daughter this morning, she was like, why do you have to go to work? I'm like, mommy's work is a little different. There's a lot of moms out there that have to work nine to five every day and they barely get to see their kids and you and I, we get to see each other all the time. So I'm so lucky, but I do have a family and a support system like no other. Is your team big? Because you have a lot of content. Do you work with it really by yourself or do you have a team that does it? Definitely, I have a team. There are four people with my password who are always online on my Instagram. Something like that. I am talking about that to convey that blogging is a job. Because many people say, oh, what did she do? Everyone can do that. And you don't understand that it's every day. Are you feeling good or not? Are you looking good or not? You must go and give some emotions. That is, we must show when everything is well and we are smiling and laughing. That's why everyone thinks, oh, how easy a life they have. Actually, this is a job. The content should be thought out even to take the TikTok video. 